two of the most famous OS out there and a lot of users using these OS we have a MIUI and Oxygen OS and these two OS has large fan base some users will definitely say that Oxygen OS is best some users will say MIUI but everyone knows inside that Oxygen OS is far better than that let's take a quick look at some differences here first of all the default launcher here if you move on to the MIUI you have some bit of extra things home screen etc but if you move on to the Oxygen OS kind of things there are no major customizations keep this you know mind oxygen os is almost based on stock one by the way i'm talking about oxygen os 11 not 12 because oxygen os 12 is equal to color os 12 so i'm not going to talk about that we are here with some bit of extra options where you have the option to change the icon pack if you want to which is of course quite useful um, and this option is not available in MIUI launcher but you can customize the icon size if you want to it's up to you the icon size option is there but yes MIUI has some kind of very very interesting options which you don't have in oxygen OS, unfortunately in oxygen OS, you can adjust the home screen layout you can customize the icon size you can even hide the app names if you want to so basically customizations are of course there in Oxygen OS, not major ones like MIUI, but it's far better than some of the things. And one of the major things you will love, why you will love Oxygen OS, is because of the performance. It is super good, super fast if you compare it with MIUI for sure. Even if you're using Portroom, that's better than the MIUI stock one. Everyone knows about that. Let's take a quick look at the settings and my device. If I move on to the my device, you can see in the right hand we have Oxygen OS where I have installed this in Redmi Note 10 Pro. And in my other side, we have MIUI 12.5 running device in a Redmi. This MIUI 12.5 running in Redmi Note 9 Pro as a port ROM. And allow that to take some other changes, some quick looks at some other things here. For example, the customizations in display. Or here, here you can see you can customize the font settings. You can simply arrange the fonts to, I mean, you can increase the boldness, etc. If I check out other things in Oxygen OS, you have some bit of extra things. For example, you have advanced settings where you have front camera display area, little options, screen calibration which is something quite useful if you want to use it and other than else almost same kind of things ambient display etc same kind of things available if i move on to the sound and vibration settings in both you can see the ui is a little bit advanced in being way if you compare it with the oxygen os but yes the real thing is how is the performance and how is the real time usage daily usage Oxygen OS is far more better and everyone knows that. If I move on to the theming section, you can see it's here in MIUI, which is unfortunately not available in Oxygen OS. You can't theme, you can't use custom themes, but you have the Oxygen OS, you have the substratum theme support. If I move on to the battery section, you can see there are better options in battery section for MIUI users, uh, while Oxygen OS does not have those options, unfortunately for you. And if I move on to the utility section, which is basically a special features option, Game Turbo Video Toolbox, all these tools are also available in Oxygen OS 2. But MIUI Game Turbo and MIUI Video Toolbox, I think so, has better options for you. Better things, I think so, you have in MIUI. And yes, if you compare it with MIUI, I think so, MIUI is far ahead in the terms of features. You can see dual apps. Yes, I don't have WhatsApp and Paytm installed in MIUI right now, so that I will not be able to show you that how much dual apps are supported here. But in Oxygen OS, this is what we have. Other than else, if I move on to the options, both of the devices or both of the OS has same kind of things. And if you take a look at the Oxygen OS UI, it's almost same like the stock one. While MIUI has a actual custom skin, which is modified, which includes extra changes, layout changes, and a lot more things. If I move on to the system settings, you can see almost same options available here and there. And yes, if I have the option of OTG storage, which is not available in MIUI, you have the option to enable or disable the OTG support in Oxygen OS which is absolutely useful in my thinking it's just my opinion and notifications and control center where you can customize the control center to the normal one or MIUI 12.5 or 13 style which of course you don't have in the oxygen os and they don't need it this is the default one which you have and looks quite good of course and a lot of fans are already here for oxygen os and yes again i'm mentioning i'm talking about oxygen os 11 it's not about oxygen os 12 
other than else miui also includes some security features where we have a cleaner which is of course kind of useful but that's i think so most of the users should ignore that miui has some basic chinese stuff basic google stuff and a lot of lags everywhere everywhere a lot of lags everyone knows that even if you're using a flagship xiaomi device you you will definitely feel lags while oxen os um, of course it is not available in some mid range devices but oxen os is always known for its flagship devices and that's absolutely perfect that's super good super fast until oxen os 11 if i move on to the options like ui changes in file manager etc by the way i'm using miui china version i'm not using miui global and india the features which you are seeing right now here in this video are from china ones and these are the features which have been in china and even you don't have these features in global or india stable so that's also one of the things to consider about other than else almost same kind of things screen recording has some extra options while as in miui in oxeno screen recorder you have better things like if you use the miui screen recorder sometimes it feels laggy but in oxeno os it's not like that theming option and me why you have some theming options so this is a plus point where you can customize the themes you can add your own themes if you want to in mtz file that is absolutely a good thing or a positive thing about that but if i take a look at the oxen os things unfortunately in oxen os you don't have the theming support you don't have the option to import your own themes but you can still do a lot more things in oxen os and if you are a real oxen os lover or user you might definitely feel oxen os is far more great and far more ahead of me why in the terms of almost everything the daily life usage is what matters and Oxygen OS is ahead of MIUI in this thing. Gallery also has the normal features like in MIUI you have edit and sky filters and a lot more things, frames, etc. Unfortunately, those options are not available for Oxygen OS users. But yes, as I just mentioned, this is not a big deal. If you need features, you can go for MIUI. But if you need stability and better performance, you might rather definitely go for Oxygen OS. It's just my opinion, as always. Other than else, almost same kind of things. You also have the Zen mode. which is quite useful you have the screen recorder as i just mentioned and it will not give you any kind of lags or something like that in oxen os while me why you have some lags you face some lags i already have the 60 fps support in this and even if you're using 120 hertz device in redmi you don't have the screen recorder up to 90 fps or 60 fps so that is also kind of really really weird other than else almost same kind of things both are custom skins both have some their own functionalities rather than the stock one google pixel or pixel base custom homes are quite better everyone knows that but if you need to go for the oem skins for example ming ui one ui or oxygen os or something like that i'll definitely prefer oxygen os at number 1 and then other than else maybe one ui etc because i haven't used one ui much i'm not sure about that but if i had to choose the skin which i will definitely love to use on my device i'll definitely prefer you to use oxygen os on your device it includes some customization options for you too you very can customize icon pack you can customize the system icon shapes if you want to you can customize the asn color which means all the basic things which a user need in a device already present in this one me we has some extra things too but uh, it's up to you by the way it depends upon your preference also but these were my opinions about both of these os as i just mentioned i will definitely recommend you to use oxygen os but if you're using xiaomi device you need to use me why so this is all thanks for watching and i hope you like this little bit long video about oxygen os versus me why i hope you like this thanks for watching i will see you in the next video until then goodbye Like I'm floating through the air